whatever. Welcome, welcome one and all to the next video. So today, I feel like we really have some base upgrading to do. Like, look at this fridge. This fridge, look, why, why do we still have this tiny fridge? It's because we have not been upgrading all our items. So we have the electric kitchen. We have the electric heater we could make. We have an amusement furniture set. Uh, I don't know about that. What else do we need? Hmm. We could probably put some lamps around at this point, right? I feel like that's a good idea. Actually, get some light going. What else? We need to put these refined metal chests in. Refridge. <laughs> um, if any of you all remember, um, I talked about the lady that I who I worked uh, no not worked with the lady whose house I visited because we were installing a fridge and she'd call it a refridge. Ah, <sighs> God. Okay, but. Come think about it. If we want to unlock all this stuff, we need to get technology points from somewhere. So I think we're going to have to really do caves. But let's at least upgrade the fridge because there's no reason not to. So maybe we'll upgrade the fridge and... Oh, yeah, um, we have to build the refined metal chest. Even though it's kind of silly because we have a refined metal chest in the coal base already. But whatever. You know what, Power World? It's just... It's fine. We'll build one here too. It's just so demanding. Uh, yeah, we also have all these eggs. Uh, celery. Okay, that's lame. Two minutes on these huge rocky eggs. I don't even remember if we knew what these were. Because we put... What do we even put in here? Did we put a dig toys in there? I... <laughs> Fuck it, fine. But, <laughs> let's see. Yeah, okay, so we put dig toys with Swift, Runner, Nimble. And then we put a Jormon tied with Ferocious and Billy Buddy. Right, 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 right. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to get Swift, Runner, Nimble, and Ferocious on one pal. All right. Well, we'll see about that in two minutes. For now, let's get that refridge going. Refridge, where art thou? Let's see. So what do we need? We're missing refined ingots. God damn it. Yeah, I, um, I did. So I put those eggs in offline, but I also... Not offline. Off stream or video whatever off you looking at me so that's why we have all those eggs i did pick up some coal so we should have enough coal to make enough refined ingots and then uh exit etc etc oh also i finally made the cold resistant refined metal armor the common the uncommon one so now we have that look at that two th two three four defense versus one wait Wait, we actually getting raided for once? Oh my god. <laughs> it's the first time we're getting raided. And it's a new raid. Thank god. The reason I didn't even mind that we weren't getting raided is because the raids are just irritating. So yeah, we're really gonna have to put up walls around here eventually because I just don't want to deal with these raids. Because yeah, you can't put up raid. Can you? Not enough stamina. What do you mean? You, you didn't even do anything. Not enough stamina. My ass. Finnicate bugs. Kind of tired of your shit already. Alright, well, you just exploded into flames. Oh, there's a bunch more of them. Alright, I forgot all these raids. Could you stop? Oh! Whatever. I am so surprised I died. <laughs> I'm so surprised I died. You know, the shitty thing about it too is too, these pals at this base are really low level. So I really hope right now I'm not about to be shot in the face. I'm not about to be shot in the face. Uh, okay. Let's run away. Oh, we have Lily Spear. That's not what we want. We want this double barrel shotgun. Let's just die. We just don't want them shooting us. So, are all my pals here just gonna die because these syndicate dogs are just fucking them up? Can you die? I'm also dying from the heat. Jesus Christ. You okay? Are they dead now? Nope. Syndicate cleanup. Ah. 
And this is why I hate these raids. <laughs> Uh, look at this guy. This guy is just run. No, no, no. You're not escaping. You are not escaping me. You have done more than enough. He escaped. I mean, escape is not the correct term. He uh, despawned. I mean, do I escape from the police if I despawn? I don't think so. I think that's just cheating. Okay, at least we got random garbage from them. Is that good? Do we want random garbage? He's gonna raise us a little bit. I don't know if we want random garbage. Also, I just realized we should just throw an appal onto the goddamn machine gun. Why did I not do that? Hmm. All right. Well, mistakes were made. That's no. I deserve to die. <laughs> it's really, it's really the point. But anyways, yeah, we get the coal. No, we don't. I just remembered there's probably coal in this locker as well, right? Please tell me there's coal in here. There's no coal. Okay, at least we have high quality pal oil. So wait, you tell me you all were here for so long and you all just collected this tiny amount of coal? <sighs> to whip these pals into shape. Also, why did I get this across here? Really, what you should really do is you should just cut, get it across here and then you have no way to move. Duh. Okay. I feel like this playlist is all over the place in terms of volume. Eh, whatever. Whatever. Jump tied ear in the way. Just love when you have to crawl to your uh, chest. I, it's my favorite activity, actually. Okay. So, disasters aside. Let's make these refining guts. So those will get made in the meanwhile. And then all right, we can check out these eggs. Hopefully we if we get something with all three speed passives plus ferocious, then we will pick a main pal for sure. Alright, so we accidentally bred Anubis again. Yeah, they, they really made Anubis way too easy to breed. This is actually ridiculous. Like the fact that we bred Anubis three times, I think only the first time was on purpose. Okay. We got Runner, Swift, and Ferocious. Let's see. Once it's seen as a symbol of nobility and an idol for those who shunned wealth and power. I was reading that. Wait, where is it? Yet over time, this pal became a token of death. It's very scary. And that was too loud. Okay, runner, nimble, ferocious, and bully body. Runner, ferocious. Come on, we could do better than that. We could do better than that. Come on, huge rocky egg. I'm really believing in you. Trash. <laughs> You're gonna get condensed. Yeah, we should actually condense an Anubis, to be honest. All jokes aside. <clears throat> and I was not joking about condensing that Anubis. Actually. Should probably keep the nimble one, right? Because we have... Okay, so we have an Anubis with only nimble. We have an, an Anubis with only swift. Maybe... We could work some out. And then we have an Anubis with only runner. Okay. I mean, at this point, I guess what we really do is just breed a ton of... Anubis. Wait, we have runner, nimble, swift, and earthquake resistant. Hmm. Hmm. All right, let's see, what, let's see what we could do here. Yeah, and I want to do this quickly because I really want to get to that fridge, that refridge. So, runner nimble, build body nimble, runner nimble swift. So we have this meal, single you out. Anubis has a really high um, percent chance, I guess, of being male. Seems that way. I mean, that is, this, we didn't even really breed enough to determine it or not. It's a really poor statistical reasoning by me. And I've taken, you know, some math courses, so I should probably know better. 
you know like when you you remember like something you learned in school but only vaguely just vague enough to know that you don't know what you're talking about yeah <laughs> uh, okay so we just need to pick up this and do this hi i'm gonna need you and you're you're actually really lucky. You get to breed with another Anubis. Yep. No, nothing weird, nothing weird and kinky going on. It's just another Anubis. So have fun. Okay, we have seven cakes in here. Let's uh, we can leave seven cakes honestly. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, I really dislike this song. <laughs> uh, I hope I hope nobody. I hope nobody was listening and they was like, oh my god, he's playing my favorite song from like when I was seven and my parents were getting divorced and it just makes me feel so warm. You, that's probably not you. And if it was, well then I am sorry. You too. Okay. So we should have enough refining guts now for the fridge. I actually struggled not to say refridge just now. <laughs> I feel like that's going to end up like one of those situations where I start seeing something ironically and then two years will pass and all of a sudden I'm seeing cool beans. <sighs> yes, that is why I say that. Okay. Let's see. Oh, we're missing three refining. God, God damn it. Ah. <sighs> Come on, somebody pump these out. Nobody's working on them. Yeah. Okay. Fine. You doing it? Nice. Okay. What's another thing we could build? Well, while, while we waiting on that. Well, the thing is, actually, this might just be a Kevin episode because we have no technology points. So we can't even unlock any, like we can't unlock the electric kitchen. We can't unlock the electric heater. We can unlock the street lamp, but that's not really um, pertinent. Here's what, I will do the refined metal chest. I think that is 100% move. But before we do that, we can at least build the fridge. Let's do that. What Pokemon song is this? This is, this is definitely like some sort of Pokemon battle song, but I don't I don't remember which game it's from. But it feels like a Gen 3 song. Right? Let me know what you all think of that. Okay. So basically all I need to do is Oh. Alright, we're just going Cleveland. Fuck this. Because here's the thing, we need refined ingots for the refined metal chest. So there's no point in us even... Yeah, we can't do it. So yeah, let's just do the fridge. So to do the fridge, what we need to do is take everything out of this crappy fridge. And then we will move it right here. All right, so everybody, you go into here. Nice. Did we get anything good back from this? Nope. Just crappy ingots and stone. I even put stone in our fridge. Okay. And then hopefully this fridge fits right here. Eh, it kinda does. Yeah, no, it does. I think what is happening is that it was just hitting the window. How's that look? Oh, I tried to jump through the window. <laughs> I was like, wait. Then I crawled up on it like um there was um is it the Koopa? No, not a Koopa. The 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 turtles, the duck the turtle ducks from Mario when they're crawling on the fence. That's what I looked like. Like, look at that. Dun, dun. Okay. Um, okay, so you're building this fridge. Thank you. We're doing it really quickly. Nice. We actually have space in our fridge now. Which will feel a lot better because we always have a bunch of garbage to throw in there. And by garbage, I mean random meats. Okay. So everything can go in there. We might as well take these cakes and give them to Anubis. Honestly. Yeah. Take 18. And then what do we need for the caves? Well, we need rifle ammo. Which means we need money. Where's my money? You gonna give me my money? Where's my money, bitch? You remember that from Family Guy? 
I think the first time I saw Family Guy was when my father was just working. He, he was, he's an electrician. So he was just like at somebody's house doing work or some shit. And I just happened to, you know, I'm a child just tagging along. But God knows why. And, oh, we have a depressed the, um, blaze hall, but I'm making the medicine slowly. So eventually we'll get medicine from him. Do you, do you make medicine? No. Okay. Don't worry. We're not going to neglect the blaze hall. Don't worry about it. Um, yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm at these people's house, you know, I'm, I'm a child. So I'm just like pissing off to some corner and they have family guy on. And I had to have been like eight, maybe. And then all of a sudden, this family guy comes on and it's just like Stewie beating up Brian and, you know, shooting him <laughs> and because he owes him money. I was like, this is the greatest thing I've ever seen. Nobody take this from me. And then we had to go. But yeah, I think that I think that's why my humor is so fucked now. Just seeing that show. OK. So I'm thinking we try these two caves. I don't even know who we have on us, but <clears throat> whatever. Oh, I was supposed to go for ammo, wasn't I? Which means I was going to go for money. But honestly, whatever. Who cares? Just wear this cold armor. And then we just head north. It's easy enough. Maybe, do we want to catch a foxicle? Might as well, right? While we're here. <gasps> Corporal of Flames, go! Hi. Oh, you actually did not take as much damage as I would have expected you to, given you're literally an ice type. Oh, you might die with it. No, you didn't. Nice. 11%? Power world, come on. Thank you. You might. Oof. That attack hits so hard. <laughs> uh. Alright. Wait, it has a fire move? Holy shit. It's actually like. Traveling. Okay. Um, I'll say some sweets. You know how much I hate sweets, so you all need to go. Cheeky bastard escaped. Up, oh, stand still. Stand still. I don't want to waste that pals here. That's enough stamina. Ow. What is this? I think this is God repaying me for um <laughs> for get getting that eleven. What? Sweet. There's just no way. All right, we kind of fucking around. Goodbye. Armor's damaged. Great. Okay, at least we caught the fox skull. Don't trust though. It's terrible. Hello. You know, I really... Do we even need to be catching chillettes at this point? I knew he was coming up to use that... Ow. That dragon attack. Stop. Where is my fire boot? Okay, we gotta chill out with Sirius at least. Alright, all right, whatever. We... Actually should probably sleep before we go on our... Um, caving adventure. As a matter of fact, I will meet you all at the cave, just so you don't have to see me getting distracted. And plus, if I know that you all are waiting, then I will actually get there on time. And just like that, we have arrived at the cave. Isn't it amazing? It took like two seconds to get here. Time really is an illusion. Okay, so there's a bunch of bees in front of us, though. So I'm thinking we deal with the bees first, just so that we don't have to deal with them afterwards. Hello. Where'd my bird go? What? Get... What's going on? Ah, uh, that was weird. He was just like not coming out of the pal box. Pal sphere. Honestly, I... whatever. At this point, I don't even want to be out here. Yeah, that's why. Get away from me! Oof, oof. 
Oof. Hi. What is this? Where is my shotgun? Jesus Christ. Okay. Everybody is really upset for some reason. <laughs> I didn't do anything. No, these bees. Yeah, flew that bomb. Oh yeah, I mean sure. I was like, can we just ignore these bees? Alright, the boss in here is level 29. That's actually a good level. Good enough to one-shot us, not so good that it's gonna be horrifying. Ah, speaking of horrifying though. Literally as I get into the goddamn cave, these assholes are just waiting here. Come on, you know what? Use Lily's Lily Spear. Come, come, take some stuff. Motherfucker. Hello. You're dead. I'm slowly gonna stab you with this piece of metal. Um, yeah. Nobody is paying attention to me. I'm not gonna question it. <laughs> Herb of roasted lamb ball. Oh, this man was uh, living large. Jesus Christ. I don't have that. Hey, Katra's here. We could actually fix our hat. Did we get two Katra's here? No, we got one. It was just showing the same thing. Okay. Well, um, Mr. Forest Fire, we are gonna run around on you. Because you have Flare Arrow, Ignis Breath, and Ignis Rage. Hmm. Ignis Rage hits really hard. Although I really don't like that we're just standing there. Where did my Ignis Rage go? Whatever. Just gonna throw that in there. Why is he not doing anything? Are you, are you okay? Are you stunned? Are you scared of the bees? What's going on? Okay, now the Ignis Rage is going off. Oh. Although I realize now, because they don't touch the ground, I don't think Ignis Rage does damage. <laughs> Which is just like, okay. Uh, I mean, I guess. You'd think that the heat would, you know, set them on fire. They're still grass types, but apparently not um okay sure why not who am i to judge how he he lives you know i am but a lowly human okay also yeah. we don't run we ride on pals okay he's stuck he is too fat what? Ooh, a Felbat. I wonder. I think we've only gotten one Felbat so far. I think we hatched it. Um, yeah, pretty sure we hatched it. I don't think we caught it. Is this Ignis Rage? Okay. Should be able to catch that Felbat there. And then there's another one. Okay. I just saved your life. You were gonna die. You're dead if you come out of that elsewhere. <laughs> you're dead. Wait, you're not dead. Wow. Actually, nine lives. All right. Oh, why are we even dealing with these devouts? They're actually really annoying. Oh, well, they're all dead. Wait, you didn't die. Solvable. Cool. All right. Ah, uh, we go in. Yay! Okay. <laughs> I was expecting that to be a little bit more dramatic. Like, I thought it would be way deeper, but apparently not. Okay. Smalls pal soul times three. Okay, well, I mean, whatever. Yeah, once we pick up our main, we will actually start... Um, ...using the pal souls. Because, if you don't know, if you, you haven't really played pal world, you can use the pal souls to enhance your... ...pal's um, stats. So... That is their main use. Also, their only use. But if you haven't watched my video on the 
boss raid coming up soon. Apparently, we will use a power soul to summon the boss. So that's actually going to be sick as fuck. Um, I wonder how much it's going to cost, Phil. Always worries me. He like pocket pair took the uh, the grindier route with power world. I'll say. I mean, I, it's not that grindy if you can if you don't play so much that you don't run out of resources immediately. Because like I don't play that much per day, so I actually have a ton of resources. But like when I first played for this game, me and my friends we lived in power world for a little bit. It was it was not good. <laughs> I mean, it was great, but also it wasn't good. <sighs> so yeah, eventually power souls are gonna have another use, which will be cool. I'm guessing it's gonna be the large power souls, right? Like I, I don't know why they, they, there's no, I don't know if they look different on the ground or not. I can't remember. <sighs> I don't even want to deal with these bees. I'm just gonna run away. I'm just gonna run away. I'm just gonna run away. <laughs> <laughs> uh, God, thank God we have the shield, huh? Okay, so what have we learned today? Blaze Hall is too fat to be a cave runner. I know, it's sad. I have to put him on the um, vegetarian diet. God, have you all heard about those people that feed their cats just like only? Only a vegetarian diet and the cat can just like waste away because of course it does. That's so sad. I don't I don't know why you would ever even think that's a good idea. I have to imagine people don't do that anymore, right? Maybe they do. A few crazies probably still do it. But it's just like the cat is just there like help me. You know? Like if you're um have watched a bunch of Family Guy, there there was um some scene with a lion that's just like starving. I think it was in relation to this very thing that I'm talking about where like the, li the lion was like fed a vegetarian diet and it's just like wasting a wee um, don't do that okay I guess we give it nightmare Bria. I'm thinking corporate flames is a dark type we have grin teals normal type so we might as well pick some dark type attacks but first of all they're not even looking at us for some reason hi I'm just gonna throw this grenade here and you're shocked. We have to watch out for the cat slam. Yeah. Cat smash. That's my f that's the first episode I did where I I decided to do the um the intro. Wow. Whatever just hit me, hit me for all of my shield. So I'm pretty sure I will just die at this point. Okay, just make sure we dodge. Our only job is to dodge. Maybe we can catch this one now? Nope. Oof, please don't get hit by that. <laughs> Actually, wait, wait, where is she? Ooh, okay. Um, 54%. Ah, actually, yeah. Because that one is caught. Nice. We don't, wait, we don't even need to catch Green Teal. So remember, we because we bred so many of them. Might be better if we catch it though. <laughs> For the sake of not dying. Although, Ultra Spheres was probably a complete waste, but eh, whatever. Workaholic and Runner. Grintail's eyes light up for the moment anyone enters its territory. You and me, bo you and me both, dog, honestly. I pull, out, I pull out the little, you know, the double barrel anytime somebody walks up on my house that I don't own. Water skill fruit aqua boost and then okay nice we got a high grade tech we got two cool so now that allows us to unlock what the electric kitchen and that's it all right cool <laughs> so we have to go and do another cube oh hi um yeah oh in the chest goodbye i'm leaving <laughs> i want part of these more sanders whatsoever oh there's a lift my cappuccino 
Oh, we have to get that. And of course I got nailed by a rock in the air. These guys um, apparently used to be baseball players or something. Hello, chest. All right. So monkeys and pandas aside, where do we want to go next? Well, the answer is obviously to this cave that's right to the west of us. See, this is why it's so good to mark the caves, because then when you actually want to find a cave, easy as shit. No big deal. Now, first of all, we want to go get that egg, right? But also, where is this cave? I'm apparently sit. Oh, <laughs> that's why. But it's also closed, so whatever. At least we get this egg. Large food and egg. It's probably a bee, right? I feel like it's a bee. Maybe there's this cave across here, so we can maybe cross the little what would you call this? This an if if Is that correct? I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna look really quickly. Can you go full screen? Ifsmus. Ifsmus. Impossible to pronounce. An Ifsmus is a narrow piece of land connecting two larger areas across an expanse of water by which we are otherwise separated. Okay, so. So it's not an Ifsmus. Cool. Well, the important thing is that I at least remember that that would even exist. Alright, so we just have to go directly west. And I'm thinking what we do. Actually, how did we get across there last time? Because we cannot scale. Oh, okay. I see. Because we cannot scale this wall in one go, I'm pretty sure. Oh, what we can do is we can just go all the way across there. And then hop across to the next island. Definitely the move. Actually, we can do it right here. As long as this place is for us to actually stop, it's fine. Hey, a red chest. Crossbow schematic one. Meh. And also, we might as well get this quartz while we're here. It's the original quartz. Our, our favorite quartz friend. Okay. Uh, oh, wow. Our inventory is actually full. Whatever. <clears throat> Now, here's the thing. So we always need to be collecting quartz, but I'm guessing eventually we just won't need to care about it once we build everything, right? So we, I don't think we really need to care about farming it. We just need to get it every time we see it. I'm hoping that is what's going to happen. I do not remember how much we need quartz, though, so your mileage may vary. But I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm right. Happily sadistic. Right, help me scale this mountainous mountain. Do we see any lift mock effigies? No, no. Okay. I mean, this song I'm listening to sounds very familiar, but I can't remember what game it's from. Does this person have what time stamp? 41, 49? Donkey Kong Country. Okay, that makes sense because I played a lot of that. Professor Oak, Pokemon Snap. Why not? See, like here, we have some quartz here. Like, we're just going to keep collecting it, right? As much of as the weight. If anything, we should just go home first. Because we're already near fast teleports. So we might as well. Because then we don't need to care about weight. And I feel like that is 100% a move. So, if anything, I will meet you all at the next cave. Okay. So we made it to the cave. Thing is, the boss is level 45. Now I'm pretty sure we cannot actually do this boss, which makes me very sad. So instead, we're gonna go maybe, maybe here. Maybe this, this cave self equivalent might be good. Or maybe we could try. Hmm. But that, the thing is, we might as well just go do a slightly less hard boss, you know? So yeah, I will meet you all at a different cave. Okay, so once again, <laughs> this is so sad. That like, 
this cave is also closed off. It's just like, what am I supposed to do? I'm trying to find a cave. So instead, we're just going to explore this mountainous area. So let's see what we can find. All right, so we're going north from the ancient civilization's ruins. Also, this is a really nice spot, by the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven or spots. So like, if you play on a multiplayer server, maybe here isn't taken up because I feel like the place that I built is, first of all, um, very commonly known in terms of, in terms of like the ore spawn. So you might as well. Oh, I am very much dying. What? What just happened? I. See, so you know how I. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> so you know what just happened? I took out Banwoom and he made me hotter, which killed me quicker. So that's literally what just happened. Thank God we died like next to the fast teleport and there's no power, so it doesn't really matter. Please. Wh where's all my stuff? Okay. That was, that was such a surprise. Are you serious? I have to climb for it? Okay. I mean, I guess. And then we just need to put on our armor. Okay, cool. Yep, Nisty, okay. Everybody's, everybody's back. Alright, cool. Alright, so I, we, I guess we don't take fire piles here because our armor is not good enough. Like, the fact that I pulled out a fire pile and immediately died is hilarious. So, Van Willem, you going back in the box. We don't want you anymore. Alright. I'm sorry. You know what it is. It's not me. It's you. Wait. Hmm. <clears throat> Need to practice that line a little bit more. <laughs> 68 Rocket Boy. Maybe we take a... Why don't we just take a Chillette? Do they even have... No, they're... They don't want to take an Eyesight. That's stupid. We can take... No one. I mean, we have this, we have attack helicopter with Lucky, Ferocious, and Blue Body, but honestly, whatever. Yeah, we just, we, we're gonna take Rocket Boy and hope for the best. Alright, cool. Oh, wait, who are we riding though? Sparky Stallion. Uh, we'll go Corporeal Flames, and that means we don't have a flyer. Hmm. Hmm, 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 So many choices. So little time. Alright, cool. Well, that's enough. I really want to just get some adventuring done. I feel like we spent a lot of time just like trying to get to places, but it's not working out. Okay. Let's accidentally use an attack. So at least now that we ride in Sparky Stallion again, it feels like we could actually move at a decent pace because he is our fastest pal. And he looks it, which is nice. Look at that, look at that, look at that majestic coat. I think any other pal can match him. I don't think so. Why is this here? Are you serious? They couldn't like not put this very awkward divot in the landscape. Okay. If you say so. Okay. Well, we head in for that chest, obviously. Because around here, because this is a high level area, the chests are just way better. So hopefully we'll actually get some good. I'm hoping there's a cave down there. No, there's not. Hmm. Where's it just? No. Oh. Do we mine this sulfur? Nah. Yeah. Nah. Because we're never really skilled. We're never really going to be buying, um, making ammo because that's just a waste. So it doesn't really make sense to care about this. Hey! A cave. My god. Imagine having a cave. Let's see what level the boss is, though. 40? Alright, fuck it. We're gonna do it. Worst comes to worst, we die horribly, and then I end the series. Lee's Punk. We have no Lee's Punks. I'm just gonna casually throw this grenade. Oh, that did nothing. Also, I don't have my shotgun. Catch? No? Okay. Wait. Oof. Spirit fire. Okay. Please. 
Wait, I wanna... Okay. What, what is this? Are you serious? <laughs> Oof. Of course. Actual devil blood. Oof. Okay. Um... Where is it? Wait, they fly? I've <laughs> never seen a Toko Toko fly. Like, actually. Never seen a Toko Toko flying ever. Yet somehow. Can you? God, this. Yeah, we need better guns. This is painful. Ah. I see. At least the music is nice. Can you please just stay in the pals fair? I, why are we even dealing with these pals? Such a pain. Alright, well at least we caught it. A pal that always takes great care to maintain a stylish stance. Always on the hunt for the coolest poses if given a mirror. It will spend all day posing in front of it. Oh, it's like the exact opposite to me. I will walk in front of a mirror. Ah. Get away from me! Oof, it's actually really close. <laughs> okay, well, mm, I'm gonna go left. Yeah, none of our pals are even close to level 70. I mean, 40. The closest is Misty's Nightmare, who is a grass type. So, hopefully, the pal that we face is not fire, or else this is gonna be terrible. Um, hello. I just want the chest. Just want the chest. I just want the chest. <laughs> it's just like running after me like first, the thirstiest woman alive. Alright, well, that was easy. We got the chest. I don't think we should just run past everything. We don't even really care about these pals. I don't want to fight them. Uh, I don't want to fight these guys either. Run! Hey, Tim! Do something! Okay, cool. We made it. What? Why do I feel like this cave was a mistake? Okay, we can go left here. So we've gone on the first left, and then there's one there, and then one on the other side as well. Right? Yeah. So maybe, yeah, I was going to say, this is probably a short one. Where we just get like a chest as soon as we enter the room. I'm hoping this other one is just like a, a one of those big rooms as well. Nice, it is. So let's see, is there a chest here? I can mostly dodge all of your gunfire because you're trash. Is he holding onto that grenade? What's going on? Haha! -ha! Y'all can't even catch me. I'm on a zebra. Okay, nice. We made it to the boss, which is a bunch of Lee's Pungs, which is good because for one reason, we have a dragon type. Yeah. Let's see if we can actually do it. I think the first thing we should do is probably kill the... Where did my grenade go? Did I just use Dragon Breath? Wait, that actually did real damage. <laughs> Alright, well, all we need to do is just dodge them, I guess. Um, Happily Sadistic is almost dead. He is dead. I don't know what just happened. Alright, well, we don't have a Dragon type. <laughs> Stop! The only way for us to beat it... Okay, this is going horribly. Um, I can't dodge all of these attacks. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, we should be able to catch one of these. If we can catch one, it'll make it a lot easier. I... Uh, 
Wait, missing no is dead too. Misty's night nickel. I'm running out of stamina. Okay, cool. Well, uh, we tried, guys. <laughs> that was so bad. I don't even know what we were supposed to do there. Like, we needed to take only dragon types, I guess. I couldn't not die. <sighs> God damn it. All right, finally, we made it back to our stuff. As you could tell by the complete lack of um, HP, it was very much of a struggle. Because as soon as I came off Doge, I would just be set on fire and it is just... Yeah. You see you see what happens. Because he's a fire type, he raises your temperature. Even though when you're on him, you don't get affected by the heat. It was uh, a little bit of a catch-22 that I got placed in. Not the best. But anyways. Let's see. Who are we going to glide with? Okay. Nobody. He's going to T-pose our way back to the fast teleport. I don't mind. Glide? No? Okay. Cool. Well, that was, um, yeah. <sighs> At least the good news is that our medicine is finally ready, so we can help out our Blaze Hall. But he's very depressed after his wife left him. Um, I guess what I need to do is I need to put you in my party, don't I? Because you will just run away, because you're stupid. Yeah. Maybe not stupid. That's mean. I'm sorry. I shouldn't call you that. You work hard on the base. Okay, cool. So you're back to full health. You're in my party temporarily. So at least if one thing we can do is first of all, I don't care about building this refined chest right now. But instead, what we can just do is we can go to the desert base. And now we could just upgrade the base because of course not because of course like why just why <laughs> ah power world. okay next thing you need to do is build the production assembly line two i don't know when we unlock that but it's probably not soon we'll see let's see let's see what level it actually is I really, 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 really wish this would just stay where you left it. Oh, wait. <laughs> we almost did. This is actually the next level. All right, cool. We're actually only 56,000 XP away from that. So we'll actually get that done next time around for sure. I'm just thinking, what else do we want? So we want the electric kitchen. Did we unlock it? Probably did, right? Yeah. Just need refined ingots. We need 27 more. And then we can build the electric kitchen. Cool. Happy with that. Uh, and there's refining guts right here. So you are no longer necessary. Oof. It's a ton of cake. Surely. When I take all these refi these ingots, I will be... Nope. Hmm. What I was hoping for is that I wouldn't have to go and deposit something else, but apparently I do. Whatever. Wait, did I not feed the... What the hell? I never actually fle fed the blaze hole. What? What did, what did even happen? What? Powered. There's just no way. Now? Look at his face. Oh my god. I am incredibly sorry. Did you take the medicine? Alright, this is actually painful. Alright, feed Blaze Hall. He's literally not taking the medicine. What? Do you not have enough space? Yeah. 
No. I won't do it. I'm thinking about doing it. Really, 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 really thinking about doing it. Alright, Forest Fire, you... It's the other beast. We're just gonna stick this blaze hole um, in a corner to be forgotten. Okay. So the thingy majig should be under food. Electric kitchen. Alright, nice. So we should probably just put them right here, right? Give a little bit of space between the furnaces. I think so. We put that there, and then we put this right about here. Yeah, okay. So we have electric kitchens now. So if anything, I'll let them build it. And then we put a bunch more cakes to cake. Craft. Bake. Let's bake. I love these Lambos. I love I love the work animation so much. It is honestly one of the best things about this game. Let's see how many cakes we can make. Sure. And then do we have some flour here? No? Do we actually use all of it? Cool. Okay, so we have the electric kitchens now. So at least we got some some base upgrades going. Like we have the fridge and we have the Electric kitchen. Why are you? <sighs> Can I pick up the correct file? No. Whatever. Oh, here's hoping to that update for the um the what do you call it? The stand, the monitoring stand. I hope to go that is this week. I don't even care about the raid anymore. I just want to assign my pals. It'd be so nice. But anyways, we're winding down. We need a berries here, but eh, it's fine. They're not going to stop. There's like way more berries than the other one. But we should at least check to see if we get a good egg. Okay, so swift, bully bodies. That's terrible. The nice thing about breeding Anubises, though, is that we can condense them. So we can make a super Anubis that will rule over our entire base. And it will be glorious. Ferocious. Okay, well, this was trash. Run of mine for man. Mm. Hey, we hatched some more Robin Quill though. I think. Yeah, these Robin Quill are the eggs that we got when we were exploring a little bit. Hmm. And a Mosanda. Meh. Whatever. At least we get more Anubises, right? So not too big of a deal but yeah so i hope you all enjoyed we you know we tried some things died a little bit too many times but at least we had fun all right so until next time thank you very much for watching and i will see you soon all right so take care